Hello everyone, I'm going to be walking you through compiling Monero in a virtual machine. So this assumes that you already got the uh, virtual box and the Lubuntu image file from uh, the original part one. Um, so we have this and so we'll go to new and we'll call it Monero yay uh, Linux and Want other Linux, and so I give it a lot of memory. Why not? That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Give it a lot of space because you're going to be putting the blockchain on it. All right. Now, before you start, go to settings, go to system, go to processor, and crank it on yours all the way to the green. This will help it compile faster. And then go to storage. Um, go to that, go to that, then hit OK, and then you should be good to go and just hit start, and I'm going to pause it while it's doing this to save me time, you know, recording, okay, well, English, you know, whatever you want, hit enter, then go to here, go to, um, you can install it and then work from there. And I think the first video explained how to install. I'm just gonna do it live, uh, so I don't gotta wait for it to install. So it's gonna boot up, and I'll pause it. Okay, so it has booted up, um, and so it's this weird kind of full screen thing. So now we're in here. You want to get the instructions for how to compile? So we'll go to the web browser, and it will take a while to load the web browser. Still don't know why Lubuntu takes a while to load the web browser. All right, now let's see if we can make it to ginger ale Monero compile. Let's try that. Oh, I got the videos. All right, let's go there. Came in. Yeah, man. No. We want the Bitcoin talk. Actually, let's see the profile. Oh. Basically, we need one of my posts where I have, there we go, compile instructions, all right, so make your way here where you have all these things, and you can just copy and paste into the terminal, and so we can get to a terminal by hitting Control-Alt-T, so by hitting Control-Alt-T, or going to terminal. And of course, it's all the way up there. All right. And then to paste into the terminal, uh, you just hit shift insert. So it'll do its thing. All right, and it's done. So control C, the next guy, shift insert. That'll do its thing. Okay, so we're back. So I ended up having to use a different ISO because the one I had used was old. Um, but I got it to work. So now we copy this and paste it into here. And that will do its thing. So I'll pause it. Okay, that finished. So that was that. Now I'll do this one. And so this is cloning the uh, the current Monero head. Um, so this is the the main repository. And yep, that's doing its thing. 
All right, that's done. So now we do CD bit Monero or CD bit that you know hit tab it'll auto complete. And now um, you can type make. So I know that I have two threads that can compile, so I'll do make J2 to make it compile faster. But um, then this relates to the little slider we set earlier with the processor cores. So I'll do that. Now that will do its thing. And this one will take a while, so you know, keep track of this little guy. We'll see how long it takes. I'm going to pause it again. So you can see it's been forever. Oh, there we go. 83%. That was good timing. Regardless, it takes a while. Okay, it finally finished. Look at all that. It's glorious. 100%. This dangerous temp nam. Okay, so now you have it built. So you go to CD build release bin, and then you'll start the daemon. And that will do its thing. So after the syncs, you can then start the wallet. So start another, uh, another terminal instance. And see. Do a simple wallet. You'll give it a file name like I am a wallet. Dot bin. Give it a crazy awesome password. Then you'll get your word seed. Then you'll write this down, and then make a poem of it and put it in a safe deposit box. And then you'll go transfer five bajillion Monero. To Gingeropolis dot payxmr dot com mix in three. Is that how it works? Let's 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 see how this works. Let's do help. And this shows you how to do stuff. And so transfer mixing count address. Okay, so we do transfer three Gingeropolis dot axmr.com and then address one and then the amount which will be five bajillion Monero and so you do that but it's not going to work because we don't have any money and there's there's no wallet huh see I pulled up my address yeah that means it's right yeah sure we'll hit yes and then it'll tell us uh, we don't have what? Uh, I guess because that's the maximum amount of Monero available. So we'll do transfer mix in three gingeropolis dot payxmr dot com, and we'll do one thousand Monero. Yes. And we don't have enough money. Uh, so, that's that's how you would send me lots of Monero. And that's how you make Monero. On a thingy. Oh, I'm not going to be able to. Yeah. That's it. Enjoy.